Hi, Vicki Hefner, Education Curator at the Berks History Center. We're in our downstairs gallery now in the transportation room, and we are looking at our Duryea car. Charles Duryea made cars in Reading for about 10 years in the very early 1900s, and his cars were very special. He patented a couple of hundred things for cars. The two most important things that he patented is his cars climbed hills and his cars went in reverse. So think about that today. We had cars that could not go in reverse or could not climb hills. That is why today the windy road to the Pagoda is known as Duryea Drive. Charles Duryea test drove his cars on that hill before they were sent out to be sold to make sure that they could climb that hill. You'll notice it does not have a steering wheel. It has instead a tiller. So when these cars were being driven, uh, you could sit on either side to steer. There was a small button on the tiller that was the gas. And as you notice, uh, there's two seats on the hood, two seats in the middle, and we also have the bucket seat open in the back. I think I would have enjoyed riding in the bucket seat the most. Charles Duryea's daughter, Rhea Duryea, was his number one test driver. Rita Duryea, I think, was a very popular woman because not only did she have a car to drive when most people did not have cars, but she had a new car every day to test drive for her dad, Charles Duryea.